Hello, everybody. We're running a little bit behind today. Had some family stuff come up, but we are here. And I will be scrolling out of White Oak. So I think this will fit just right on this piece. I just grabbed it, didn't really plan on it. If anything is an MDF, I'm using um, like the Duck brand white contact paper. Uh, I feel like it's a little bit thicker and it stays on the hardwood better. So I just usually spray it with oops, just adhesive spray. I do it off my workbench because I don't like when it gets over things. Sometimes I don't clean the nozzle and it has a mind of its own. Top part, just wanted to make sure it got on the oak board. I think we're set. So I'm using the modified geometry blades. Um, they should be linked in the description, but I use them for everything. I don't use any other blade. Um, they are by Pegas and they are on the Bearwood site. If you haven't tried them and you scroll or want to try scrolling, just get them. Don't even bother with other blades. I've tried so many and these are the most inexpensive and highest quality that you will find. Like guaranteed. So I don't know a single person that doesn't like these blades and I know a, pretty, a good amount of scrollers. And yes, I'm cutting with the paper as a guide. Um, like I said, I'm not super married to the line. It's just like a branch image that she sent me and said she just wants something that looked similar to it. I wasn't able to turn the board when I was doing this and I cut further this way than I wanted to. So I'm just gonna, sometimes I'll take a pencil and I'll just draw over here or I'll just look and I'll cut it a little more this way. I mean, it doesn't really matter. It's just, it's a branch. So I don't know, hopefully people can uh, take that and kind of run with it. Alright, so I just have this piece and this piece to cut out. We're done. Hockey. <laughs> That's funny. See how nice it is to take off with the contact paper and I won't have anything stuck in the grain. Pretty cool. Yeah, so this is going to be going on part of this so obviously it's a little bit thicker than I want I'm gonna do a lot of shaping um, I'm trying to think of exactly what I'm gonna do I might incorporate some standoffs with the birds um, so the birds um, they're not gonna be like carved completely 3d like actual birds will be you know flattened a little bit um, and I might have them on standoffs like onto the board and then I don't know, I'm gonna figure it out, but I'm gonna make it look cool. <laughs> so I'll probably figure out some of that stuff before Wednesday and then save some stuff to do with you guys. So I'll have it a little bit more figured out, but I'll probably do some shaping or fixing up of some of these because I want them to be a little pointier um, than the picture was. I like more like those. And then this is obviously a little bit too thick, um, but it's fine because I can take it off. So anyways. Thank you guys for joining. Um, hopefully you saw a little bit more into the behind the scenes and the craziness that happens um, in my shop, <laughs> just moving things around everywhere. But I will hopefully see you guys Wednesday. So I hope you guys have a good rest of your weekend. <laughs>